Starting and stopping the disc sander is very simple. Here you have the start and stop control button, interconnects to the motor, and the motor outputs to the plug on the back, it hooks into the vacuum cleaner if you wish to have that. Pumps very nice, really well balanced. On your motor, as your motor is balanced right, using a proper motor. I'm using a, a horse and a half size motor. This is plenty of power. It runs at about 15 amps. It just comes along really nice. Stop it is really easy. Remove the paddle switch if you want. Just use a simple on off. that it's very easy to change the angle on this disc sander. And it goes down and up just a slight, slight amount. You can vary the angle of the hole anywhere you want. Just simply tighten up the knobs. And go across any way you want. And even at angles, the lighter gauge will slide back and forth. I do lots of work with plastics, and so a setup like this is great because I have a seven and a half inches of room from point to point. Here I'm using a 100 grit disc. Um, it's not too smooth, it's not too coarse. make nice, really nice round turns, or straight, or whatever you wish.